Right, here is my video for the M36 Jackson. Now this used to be called the Slugger, now it's called the Jackson. I don't know why they changed it, but that's the way it is. Still one of my favourite tanks of uh, this game. Um, I love it because it looks really good. I think I base my assumptions on how good a tank is by how good it looks. That's probably why I like the Panther as well, because it does look very nice. Now this video is a little different from the last team, uh, tank destroying video you saw. That was, you know, sitting, sniping basically. This one is a little different in the sense that I go quite aggressive. I get into a decent position on the right hand side. We're supposed to be defending by the way. So uh, the right hand side is over here, or the left hand side depending on how you look at it. The left hand side of the map, uh, but the right hand side to me. Um, and I get into a nice position where I can basically uh, sit and snipe. And then I realise to myself, why? Why not just move even further forward with the rest of these guys? If I need to pull back, I pull back. And if I can push forward, I push forward. So I'm going to use my decent front armour and very decent weapon to uh, try and take some people down. So, I see the Stug here, I get a good sh first shot off on, on him, I don't track him unfortunately and he heads down the hill. Now this is probably one of the best shots I've ever done in my entire life. I lead him and I get lucky. I get incredibly lucky with that shot. I don't know if he stopped or if he was still moving, but because I couldn't see him I had to lead him as best as I could. And I judged him to be at the bottom of the hill and he was at the bottom of the hill. So at this point I'm in a good mood because I've just hit someone that I wasn't expecting to hit. I get a nice little bounce and I miss a couple of times over the next couple of minutes. And I'm kind of starting to lose a little bit of this confidence because I'm thinking to myself, why am I missing so bad, badly with this weapon? Because this weapon and my crew is actually really well trained. I mean, the crew's 100% and I think I've got 90s in the camouflage. So I'm thinking to myself, how am I missing? And then I get a really nice shot on this vehicle here, the uh, the VK, uh, which I quite like. I, I like the look of that vehicle. Um, I get another hit, and I get some nice kills. And then this heavy, and I'm thinking to myself, if I, if I stay here, I'm going to get hit real bad, especially from the uh, church and on the right there. So I'm going to move in the best I can, and see if I can take this heavy tank head on, because it is a pretty lame heavy tank. Um, Unluckily for me, I don't manage to get the kill on that, but I did take a, a good amount of any, um, health off. And then I encountered the Churchill. Now this Churchill, for some reason, managed to completely miss my shots when I was shooting at him. I must have missed like three shots completely. Like that. The reticule was in, almost completely um, on him, apart from like a little section to the left. And yet I manage only to completely miss him. And then I get a nice hit on his turret. And now I'm thinking to myself, I might push here. And I push. And I bounce a couple of times. Well, I'll penetrate but don't do no damage, which I don't understand how that works. Obviously I didn't hit any, any vital part. And I bounce. And I'm thinking to myself, I'm never going to be able to take this out. And lo and behold, I don't manage to take it out. So at this point, i am two, literally got two kills. I could have had four. Easily could have had four. Um, and I'm thinking to myself, I'm probably not going to get any more now. This is, it. This is the last. The, these last few are going to be mopped up from the guys over here. And normally, because I'm a tank destroyer, I think to myself, okay, then I need to stop and I need to start hitting these. And then I get that kill, and I think to myself, fuck it, I'm just going to push. I'm just going to push like crazy. So I'm going to push right into the middle here. A stupid um, 
idea for someone who is a tank destroyer with weak side and back armor, um, especially surrounded by uh, other tanks that have better maneuverability than me, although this tank is quite decent for maneuverability. I'm thinking now, I mean, surely this is going to be finished off without me getting any further kills. I've got three. Can I get any more here? And I missed a shot there, which if I'd have hit, I would have definitely got this kill. Because when I hit him here, I take out nearly all his health. And then before I get a chance to hit him again... He gets taken out. So if I'd have managed to get my th that first shot off, he would have been dead. Now this is the tank that I bounce on once, and then I managed to get a decent shot here. And then he will, he will basically retreat and try and flank. Unfortunately for him, I can shoot through here. This very nice little shot when he pulls around the corner. And goodbye. So that is kill number four. Technically, I should have had seven. Seven, but it doesn't matter because you know that's the way it is sometimes. I get a nice hit on this guy, and hopefully, I'm thinking to myself, Can I get a fifth here? Can I get the number five? I miss completely, which is unfortunate. My second shot is a decent hit though. And before I can reload again. second hit on him. And then I, before I reloaded again, he was taken out. Yeah, it's always the way. So, technically, I should have had eight kills, if you thought about it. But, I mean, I got a very decent amount of um, XP for that, especially with the premium that I was on at the moment, which I like to do every three or four months, just to go on premium for a couple of weeks. And uh, here is the results.